Hello you guys. So I'm actually so excited to be filming this because I'm finally going to be walking you through all of the videos that I took while Keiko and I were telling family and friends. There's just so much backstory I need to tell you for almost every single video. So I felt like I should sit here and talk you through each one as they come instead of just combining all the videos because some of them need some context. So that's what we're going to do. And that's what this video is all about. We started telling people as early as the day we found out up until the day before we announced it to the world. So um, we were trying to tell as many people as we could in person. So most of my family family we told in person and then majority of his family we told through FaceTime just because one night he just wanted to sit down and like FaceTime all of them and tell them so we decided to do that and we don't get the chance to see his family in person as often as my family so that's just how it worked out and also we didn't get recordings of telling his friends because he only told a few of his friends before we announced it and we basically didn't get any videos because it's just not as natural for him to pull out the camera and record um, as it is for me because obviously this is what I do so it's like not a surprise when the camera comes out you know so just that type of thing but we're so excited that everyone knows and we were so excited to tell our family and friends like we just could not wait it was so hard but we did it and I'm gonna walk you through some of the videos so let's just get into it I am 12 weeks pregnant now here's the bump we're excited <laughs> excuse me hi Okay, you guys, so the first person that's in this video is my sister, Brittany. So we told her the day we found out because, like I said, we wanted to tell, it, we wanted to tell everyone in person and she was the only person that day that we could see in person and we're like we just need to tell someone like we can't hold this in any longer so yeah we went over to her house basically no plan of how we were going to tell her all i know was that i brought a onesie and a test and we we're going to figure it out so i folded up the white onesie and she has three kids they always come over to our house so i folded up a onesie i said you left riley's shirt at my house um who is her three-year-old so it kind of looked like a baby shirt you know she knew right away because she was like uh, he doesn't own any white shirts because obviously he's a toddler. He's messy and that's kind of how she knew she started freaking out and yeah Okay, the next person is my mom. So Keiko wasn't here to tell her with me because um, she was the one who was taking me to the airport when I was flying to go see Julia for her bachelorette party. So this was the night before she spent the night at my house and we were about to eat dinner and I was like, I just need to tell her. I can't sit here and eat dinner with her without her knowing. So I was just like, I have a surprise for you. So I told her to close her eyes and hold out her hand and she said she like, Obviously, I was getting feelings already that that's what I was going to tell her. So yeah, I put the test in her hand and she felt around and she knew exactly what it was. So this was such a sweet moment because she was so excited. Being a grandma is like the best thing ever to her and yeah. What is it? I know. <laughs> Like what the heck? Reason? Yeah. Like after you're married, recent? Yeah. Like found out like two days ago, recent. So you're very. So I'm like. Very. Yeah. Like, very, early. very early. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Congratulations. My sister Brianna and I was so excited to tell her I had to wait till after we came back from my trip to tell her which was like over a week that I knew before I could actually tell her and her husband and this was what this one was so special because she's also pregnant right now and we've always talked about like being pregnant together and she was like this is my last baby so if it's gonna happen you got a few months so she's due in October I'm doing February so the babies are gonna be like four months apart they're gonna be best friends and we were so excited so yeah I went over to her house I bought two onesies, one in like a zero to three months, one in the newborn size, matching onesies. I handed them both to her and this wasn't really a surprise because I've been buying her baby clothes. She found out she was pregnant so like I've been just giving her gifts and stuff. 
So that's what she thought it was. And then she saw the second onesie in the back, which is the newborn one, and she was like, are you pregnant? And that's what happened. And then my brother-in-law, Canella, who is her husband, was saying that he knew it because apparently he told her that day before Keiko and I went over there for dinner that he knew that we were gonna tell them that we were pregnant. So yeah, just a special moment. It's so fun being pregnant with somebody else, especially your sister who you're so close to. So, so fun and we're so happy. <laughs> Kano, you too. Oh, hey! Oh, really? Yeah, because you're It's for us. Can I have to open my hands too? It's vlog day, yeah, it's vlog day. Let me give you a present and record it. Literally the only thing. It's vlog day. <laughs> the only thing that threw me off was that you just went on that trip. But if you didn't do that, I would expect it. But, baby. But Say baby. recording it at the same time. Yay! I've had a child with another sister. Now I'm done. You're having a you having a baby. Did you know? I think it's a son. That's yeah, that's what I just said. It's a boy. I think it's a son. Wait, so everyone, you found out like two weeks ago. Um, Friday week. And you left on Friday. I can't believe it took it took a week for you to tell me. Yeah, you know how <laughs> crazy I can go. Like you waited this long to tell me. Person, you remember I just throw my pregnancy test to you? Yeah. <laughs> On the first one? They had him and Dad being Well, no, we were in Utah. Say congrats, Dad. Yeah. High five. I know I need to. Yeah. High five. Shake. Shake. No, no, Shake. Shake. No, I need one too. No, was that so? Was that like first try? Um. Something like that. I mean, oh, you, you guys, guys literally just hit a month. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no. They just not even first, a month. First try. They just they only tried on marriage. It's been a month. We yeah. It, okay, next is my dad and his girlfriend. So we went over there for like a little pool party, which we do all the time. And we were so excited that they were there because they're usually working and we're usually just there without them. But they were there and I had no plan on how to tell them. So I pulled out a camera. I was acting like I was taking a picture of them. So I was holding up the camera and then I had my test. I had the pregnancy test in my shorts and I pulled it out like this. I was just like, say cheese. And then yeah, my dad was 
super happy they're like shocked like everybody in this video is shocked but not because they knew it was gonna happen eventually they just didn't know when but like surprised that it was so fast kind of thing that he was like going like this because it's gonna be baby number nine grandchild number nine which is crazy um so yeah say hi hi say cheese cindy say cheese Number nine. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my goodness. 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 Oh, my so we're gonna have like two weeks. Well, we're gonna have like probably in that same week. Birthday. In June? Um, probably. Oh, February. Wow. Yeah. So right now it's five weeks in June. So you know, February. Okay, this next one needs a lot of explanation. So this is me telling my brother Andy and my sister-in-law Kendra. So. Same day as when I told my dad, but we were all there for the pool party. If you can, like, you're kind of gonna be able to see in the video, but my dad and Keiko are both sleeping on the couch. Sleeping, like, the exact same way. Like, their heads are the exact same way, their arms, like, everything. And my sister-in-law, Kendra, texted me this. I'll insert it right here. My response to her text was, oh, dads, or something. Like, dads, plural. This whole time, I'm in the same room as her, just, like, on the other side of the room or, like, in the kitchen or something. So, when I texted that, I expected, like, an immediate, like, response, you know, like, in person. But it was kind of taking a while for her to respond. And also, I was thinking that she was going to show my brother the conversation too before it was like verbal conversation you know what i'm talking about like the tech but she didn't so my brother was so confused the whole time and then once it finally like clicked in her brain this is what happened but yeah they were so excited my brother was still so confused the whole time until she showed him the text and then he was like wait what like you're pregnant yeah and then my niece came over and hugged me which is their daughter and it was a sweet moment <laughs> Now we get into telling his family, which is the night we told basically all of them on FaceTime. One person we didn't get was telling his mom, which is the first person in his family that we told. She was in Hawaii, so we FaceTimed her, and we didn't get the video of this, but she was so happy. She just immediately started bawling because she's so excited. And yeah, it was a very sweet moment, but this is us telling all of his family. First, we called his brother Jai, and literally, I don't feel like any of these need explanation because they're all so self-explanatory and like all of them had kind of the same reaction, which is cool. But yeah, we told his brother Jai. Calling to tell his fam. Oh. What's up? What's up, fool? I'm gonna turn my fan off, Katie. What are you doing? What does it look like? Where's Alina? Uh, she's at SeaWorld with Jasmine. Still, what are you guys doing? Oh, uh, no way. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, we're calling. 
calling people to let them know. <laughs> Congrats, Uncle. Yeah, yeah dude. Excited. Thanks, man. All right, dude. We'll we'll talk. We'll talk. Uh, we found out last week. And then we called his sister Jasmine, who is also with Jai's girlfriend Alina, and they're at SeaWorld. So we were, we told them while they were there, and they knew right away too. So that was fun. Are you are you guys pregnant? <laughs> Sitting here like this. I'm gonna get the cookies. Oh my gosh. Wait, I'm gonna be done. Yeah, we're calling all you guys tonight, so. How are you how you feeling, Lauren? I'm good right now. I'm just tired, but that's yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> that's it so far, which is good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm so excited. I literally, oh, I don't know, I just started walking in. I literally have been like, somebody needs to have a baby because it ain't me, but somebody. That's, that's, that's gonna, gonna be you. Be that. I'm so excited for you guys. Thank you. We're excited. And then we called his sister, Samantha, and her husband, Nick, so they were both there. And they both knew too, so no surprise. Hi. Sorry, let me turn off the light. Hi, Rocco. <laughs> What's up? <gasps> Damn, y'all are ready. <laughs> oh, Nick, just, Nick just leaned over. He's like, is she pregnant? I'm like, I think so. <laughs> Congrats. Oh, I'm happy for you guys. Rocco's going to be a big brother. And then we called his other brother Cameron, and he was also not surprised. He like knew right away, but that was fun. What's up? How you doing? I just got home from Flag and dealing with Ori, who's screaming and crying in my ear. We're gonna golf, man. Um, I don't know. I don't know when you wanna go. Lauren, are you pregnant? Am I what? Huh? Am I what? So are you pregnant? I fucking knew it. It's in my language. Sorry. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank I knew you right away and I was like, okay, well, okay, Cole's FaceTime me and Lauren's next to him and they're going to tell me something. I said, I was like, this doesn't look very um, casual. No, normally he's like walking around looking like an idiot and then yeah. you're in the background. You're like, hey. Exactly. Well, let's go. Congratulations. Yeah. That was ass. I know. Turns yep. out the welcome seat is a thing, huh? You gotta, you gotta catch up. Yeah, Combined with the Lauren's family who has 75 kids there too. Yeah. How are you feeling? Feeling okay? Good, just tired. That's yeah. it so far. I mean, that's just what k -Cola does to you without you being pregnant. Yeah, I don't so. even know if it's pregnancy. Then we called his dad because his dad answered last. So, yeah, he's so excited for us too. And they were all just so happy responses. Every single response we got from family was amazing. And we are just so happy. So, yeah. What you guys doing? I made some cookies. You're a baker in it? I know Lauren baked them. I'm not a baker. I make cookies. <laughs> What's up, you two? Thanks. You guys look tired. Yeah. What? Guess what? What? Is... <laughs> what? Congratulations. Thanks. All right. Well, your dad predicted it. Yeah, I know. Everyone did. <laughs> All right. Well, congratulations. I'm happy for you guys. We're excited now. Well, either way, you guys are going to make either a beautiful or a handsome baby. And it's so Awesome. All right, now on to telling my friends. Like I said, we didn't get really videos of telling his friends, which is sad, but it's okay. The one he did film, which was like his best friend, we recorded the FaceTime and it like, the sound didn't work, so not, not worth it, you know? This is me telling one of my best friends, Ellie. She came over for dinner one day. We were chilling basically the whole day, had dinner, watched show like the whole time, and I was like, I do not know when the heck I'm gonna tell her. So the sunset, we looked outside and the sunset was beautiful, so I was like, so I was like, let's go outside and take like a video or something or like a picture or something. So I set up the camera and she said she like wasn't surprised that I was doing this because obviously I take a lot of videos and pictures and it was like pretty sunset. So I thought it was just gonna be like a cute little video of us with Rocco and stuff. And then I had the test in my shorts and I pulled it out. Yeah, those reactions. So sweet. Um, I love her so much. <laughs> Rocco, look. Oh. Come here, Rocco. Have to take a cute Rocco. video. Oh, big jumps. Big jumps, big jumps. Rocco, Rocco, give me your ball. Give me your ball. 
Okay, the next person was my friend Celise. She's one of my college friends, so she came over one day for brunch and then I knew she was gonna wanna look through the wedding photo album, so I snuck the test in like one of the picture slots on like the second page, so when she flipped it, she would've seen. But she thought it was negative at first, so she was like, she thought it was just in there for like, I don't know, a keepsake or something, so she was so confused, but then when she finally got it, she, it finally made sense to her. So cute. How was this? Cause you, you stayed somewhere and then you drove. We had an Airbnb, yeah. And then, but we got ready like at the kind of. What was this? Huh? What was this? <laughs> ah! I'm like not pregnant. Oh my god! Did you put this here on purpose? Yes. <laughs> Are you joking? No. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm so happy for you guys. I was so confused. I know you were. Oh my gosh. Okay, now this was going to dinner with some of my friends. So my friends, Abby, Alex, Bella, Julia, and Ellie also. But Ellie's the one who I already told previously, so she was able to just record. So we kind of planned ahead of time that um, she was gonna get up and like act like she was taking a little picture of us with our sushi and whatever. And so we did that and then, yeah, you'll see what happens after. But they were all so excited and so happy. And yes, we're eating sushi, but I was not eating raw fish. It was all cooked, so. No one come at me. <laughs> Say cheese. One, two, three. Okay, so this is telling Julia and the um, audio didn't work from FaceTime, so that's really unfortunate, but I'm just gonna kind of explain to you what happened. So this was right before her bachelorette trip, obviously, because I had to tell her that I was pregnant before I went on her bachelorette and wasn't drinking and all that stuff. So FaceTimed her before and um, I was I texted her before and I was just like, hey, I have a couple questions about this week, if we can like FaceTime. And then she was like, yeah, but then we did. And I was, I think I said something like, so do you allow pregnant people on your bachelorette trip? and I held up the test or something and she was so surprised and Keegan was there too so it was fun. And yeah, we just talked for a while, but that was basically it. <laughs> okay, you guys, that was basically all the announcements that we had recorded. We told a lot more people, but just did not get their reactions, um, which was sad, but we're so grateful to have such supportive friends and family in our lives, and like, we're just so happy. And I wish Keiko could be here to film this part of the video with me, but he is working, so. But yeah, make sure you subscribe if you have not already to join the fam and to join this amazing journey. I don't even know what else to say other than I'm so, so excited, so happy, so blessed, grateful and I love you all so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!